Oh, I'm not going to use that one. No, no, I mean, is that free? Oh. Yeah, of course. Would you like one? Yes. I'll Hallelujah. Take one. This is the Gospel of John. You God bless, sir. God bless, sir. It's Bible. You got to read it. Read Bible. it. Yeah, it's good. Take one home and read it. I'll share with you one scripture, my, my man. I got a big Bible at home, but never had the chance to read. But so oh, I see. This I'm is gonna start reading. this is called a kickstart. So kickstart, it's yeah. the Gospel of John. It's yeah. very doable. You can do it in an hour when you when you're chilling out. Sort of checking Facebook and Twitter. Read about what's happening in the Word of God. Read about the end times. Read about the beginning. This starts off in the beginning was the Word. I'll share with you one, yeah. one passage of yeah. Scripture. Yeah. Jesus yeah. says, Matthew 24 and 14, He said, And this Gospel of the Kingdom shall be preached in all the world for a witness unto all nations, and then the end shall come. We've forgotten there's an end. There's a beginning and there's an end. And we've got to inquire the Word of God, what it says about the end times. How come we can go to a Kajarina cinema, we watch the movie from the start, middle to the end, but we think, we just think life's just going to go on. There's a closing, there's a last chapter, and uh, you inquire. God bless. I'm Aaron. Oh, I'll give you one of these. Oh, yeah. Tell me, what do you know about Jesus? What do you know about our Lord and Savior? Strong. What's, what, hey? He's strong. He's strong? Yeah. <laughs> he meant he's strong. You ever call upon his name? Does he help you? What's he stronger than? Who, who's our Lord stronger than? Amen! How do you know about this? Tanzania. 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 Yeah. Well, many in Africa are very spiritual people. Yeah. Your parents still go to church? Yeah, they still go to this school now. How about you, man? Yeah, I go here and there. Here and there? Yeah. Well, this is not a time to to muck around, eh? This is the last time, eh, my man? What's your name? God bless. My name's Bonnet. Bonnet? Bonnet, yeah. That's a French word? Yeah. God bless. <laughs> That's a, this a, I'll leave you boys with one scripture. I know you're heading home. Yeah. But I'll leave you with this. Matthew 24, verse 14, it says, And this gospel, this is this, the gospel, And this gospel of the kingdom shall be preached in all the world for a witness unto all nations. And then the end shall come. The end is coming. The gospel's going out. The north, south, east, and west. Every tribe, every nation, every language. There's a closing end. But we watch a movie from start, middle, and we think there's, there's an end. No, 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 you do you to go to school, boys. God bless. There's an end, boys. We agree. God bless. God bless. Yeah. Talk to us, please pray for us. Uh, yeah, amen. Uh, these are the last days. We're in the final hour. Jesus comes back like a thief in the night. At an hour, we don't know. He's given us time. By the, the grace of God, unmerited favor, He's telling everyone, we're all going back to our rooms. We're not allowed to go out. It's time to think, reflect, and pray. It's a time to start reading again. It's a time to start praying again. His grace and, and, and uh, unmerited favor and love towards us, not willing that any should perish, but that all should come unto repentance. He's, he's given time for all peoples of all nations, north, south, east and west, to repent and turn to the living, breathing God. North, south, east and west, from every tribe and from every nation, the indigenous, the non-indigenous, the, 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 the American, the English, it doesn't matter. He's calling his children back. He's calling his children, his children back, back home. This is the great calling. Today, if you hear his voice, harden not your hearts, as in the pro provocation. Today, when you hear the word of God, we've got we to gotta eat this like bread. This is the bread of God. Matthew 4, 4, Jesus said, Men shall not live on bread alone, but by every word that proceedeth out of the mouth of God. Every word that proceedeth out of the mouth of God. Australia, we have forgotten the word of God. We forgot the fear of God. Now this is a scripture for you, all three of us today. Isaiah 55 verse 6 and 7. Seek ye the Lord, or he may be found. Call ye upon him while he is near. Let the wicked forsake their way, and the unrighteous man his thoughts, 
and let him return unto him. And he will have mercy upon him, and unto our God he will abundantly pardon. So we've got to be real, we've got to say, God, if I've strayed away from the sheep, in this life I've strayed away, for some of us we strayed to the bottle, we strayed away from, from God, we, we, in our drinking, we strayed away like a sheep meant to be a flock, and we strayed away. He's saying, come back, come back. In Jesus' mighty name. John 10. Yeah, amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Thank you, Lord God Almighty. mighty name we pray. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Alright, aunties, God bless. God bless, God bless.